Hey everybody, it's Jeff from New York and I'm here in Atlantic City on a beautiful summer evening. I'm gonna check out Tony's Baltimore Grill. A lot of you people requested that I go there and one thing led to another and I just never made it, but I'm down here on the uh, southern end of the boardwalk. Just did a review or a tour, I should say, of the Tropicana Hotel and Casino. Now I'm gonna head over to Atlantic Avenue, which is two blocks in from the boardwalk and check out Tony's Baltimore Grill. If you're wondering exactly how to get to Tony's Baltimore Bar and Grill, well, it's right here off the boardwalk by the Tropicana, by Chickies and Pete's here. Uh, just head inland two blocks and you'll come to Atlantic Avenue and it's right there. Come on, I'll show you. Behind me is the Ritz, one of the more older buildings here on the Atlantic City Boardwalk. It's now a condominium, but it's a national landmark. I'm pretty much just following the um, northern edge of the Tropicana, which is this building right here. Uh, following it all the way down to Atlantic Avenue, which is only two more blocks, well, two blocks from the boardwalk, only one more block to go. So I think I'm gonna order a pie and a beer. I haven't eaten all day and I'm kinda of hungry. It's about, uh, I don't know, 9, 9.30 in the evening. So uh, let's head inside and see what this place looks like inside. This is Clarice, the Miss America crown. She's hidden in all my Atlantic City videos. Sometimes she's easy to spot and other times she can be quite elusive. If you spot her, leave a comment below on the timestamp where you found her and you'll get a shout out on an upcoming video. And a shout out to Deborah Camacho who found Mitzi, the rubber ducky showgirl, in my last Las Vegas video, Hershey World, and the M&M store on the Las Vegas Strip. Congratulations, Deborah. The menu here is pretty cool. It's a little of everything, but not overwhelming. And I'll tell you, if you look at these prices, what a difference two blocks off the boardwalk makes. For starters, let's see, they have you peeled shrimp, they have bruschetta, they have bacon wrapped scallops, uh, AC scallops a la carte. They also have a seafood special, which has a fried shrimp, crab cakes, scallops, fries, and coleslaw. And that sounds pretty cool. It's market price, so we don't know what the price of that is. They also have wings here. They also have platters like a shrimp basket or chicken tenders or eggplant parmesan and soups and salads. They also have a nice pasta selection. They're known for their spaghetti and meatballs, but they have other sauces as well, including clam sauce, white or red, and uh, a meat sauce and just good selection. All the pasta dishes are served with bread and they also have sandwiches and wraps. The usual, you know, meatball parm, eggplant parm, stuff like that. But what they're really known for is their pizza. They have a 12 inch pizza. We used to call that a bar pie. I don't hear that term that much anymore, but we used to call it a bar pie, like an individual pie. But this one's 12 inches and I gotta tell you when it came, that can pretty much serve two people, especially if you're ordering an appetizer. A plain red or white pie is $12.95 and if you want a specialty pie, they're 17 bucks. I ordered the margarita pie, which is sliced tomato, provolone, AC basil. I have no idea what AC basil is. I know what basil is, but, uh, and garlic. The back of the menu tells you the Tony Baltimore's Grill history, or their story. It was established in 1927, and the drink menu's on the back of the menu as well. And again, you can pause the video and read the story. Tony's Baltimore Grill is also known for their happy hour, which is four to six every day. It includes a draft beers for two bucks, Let's see, they have mozzarella sticks for a dollar, fried shrimp for two dollars. You can get two meatballs with bread for five bucks. These prices are crazy low. But what does it taste like? <laughs> This 
place is Screaming New Jersey. I ordered a 12 inch margarita pie and a draft beer. Ah, that tastes good. Did a lot of walking today. Hey, if you're enjoying this video, please hit that subscribe button and smash that thumbs up. It really does help the channel out. Couldn't finish the pie. I could finish the beer. And uh, they offered me a box, but I got a long walk back to Bow. The beer and the specialty pie came to 22 bucks without tip. So it was something I've been wanting to do for a long time and it was, the food was pretty good. Was it the best pizza I've had here in Atlantic City? No, but it was a great experience and I did enjoy the pie anyway. And of course, can't go wrong with a beer, right? So the bill came to about 22 something, I think, without a tip. And again, I enjoyed the dinner and I love the atmosphere. It's definitely New Jersey atmosphere in there. Uh, old time like diner, tavern kind of atmosphere. Um, the pie was good. It was a margarita pie with uh, fresh tomatoes and fresh mozzarella, fresh basil, and garlic. I didn't taste the garlic, but I like a lot of garlic, so maybe it was on there. I just didn't taste it. But again, I would definitely go back and probably order uh, some other items on the menu and see what they're about, so we'll see. And from what I understand, uh, Tony's Baltimore Grill has a great happy hour, too, and I'm always looking for a good happy hour here in Atlantic City. So it's 20 after 10. I'm staying at Bally's for two nights. This is my first night. And uh, so it's a little walk from uh, the Tropicana to Bally's. And I realized also that I have no video ready for tomorrow's noon upload. So my plans are to head over to Bally's, stop off at Dunkin' Donuts and pick up some kind of donut or pastry or something and a big old cup of black coffee and work on a video for you guys for a couple hours and i'm sure i'll have it up tomorrow probably a las vegas video um and that's it those are my plans for the night i hope you enjoyed our trip to tony's baltimore grill i had a good time i'm glad i finally did it and i stay tuned for lots more from the new york channel A new feature on the New York channel is the super thanks button which is close to that thumbs up button that I know you've already clicked on. Clicking on that super thanks button not only shows your support for the New York channel but really helps the channel grow. 
In doing so, we'll let you leave a colorful comment pinned above all other comments here on this video. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please like, comment, ask some questions, and most importantly, subscribe by clicking on the button on the left. You can visit all of my New York videos by clicking on the top right, or check out my videos on other favorite places to visit by clicking on the bottom right. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you around the city.